Walkers with the shade. They said they ain't want no more op makeup. So. What's good, Shady Gang? Welcome back to another show with August with the Shade. Listen, go ahead and grab your cups, because you already know I'm about to spill the tea, and y'all know I keep the shade. Today's video is going to be about Lil Wayne and Nicki Minaj dropping on the same day. Let's get into the tea. Lord, everybody has been in my inbox like, oh my God, are Nicki and Lil Wayne okay? Why is Wayne dropping on the same day as Nicki Minaj? Y'all, calm down. I mean, as weird as it looks to me, I mean, don't think that I don't think of it or look at it as a weird thing, but... Everything is done strategically. Let's just say that. Let's just say that the label, sometimes they give you these dates, y'all. Like, some people drop in the first quarter. Some people drop in the third quarter, fourth, however it goes. If the label gives them the date, that's the date, y'all. So, there's nothing we can do about that. But I don't think that these two are beefing because they are dropping on the same day. These are two iconic goats. One of the artists that is on that, we, that we're talking about, you know, basically brought out Nicki Minaj. He introduced us to Nicki Minaj. So, I don't think that ever we have some type of, you know what I'm saying, problem with the queen. I feel like they both are... Just ready to put out their art, y'all. They are nothing like these label um, industry plants, okay? They've been doing music for a very long time, and people really like their music. Lil Wayne has his own fan base. Nicki Minaj has her fan base. And the good thing about these two um, artists is that both of their fan bases are, like, connected in a way. So, I feel like as we're supporting Nicki Minaj, we can support Lil Wayne as well. I don't think that it's a bad thing that these two are dropping on the same day. I actually think it's a good thing. Let's talk about it. So, number one, the reason why I feel like it's a great thing that they're dropping on the same day because it brings us back this nostalgic feeling, feeling when they used to drop songs on the same day, when they used to drop, drop songs with each other's verses in it. I mean, you know, I don't know. It's just brings back this nostalgic vibe of like competition and i love competition with the best rapper like if we're gonna if nikki gonna compete with anybody compete with the best rapper alive you know what i'm saying that's what nikki says she says she thinks she's the best rapper alive so why not compete with the best you feel what i'm saying so this is a great thing let's just say that number two i feel like Nicki minaj isn't competitive to someone that she looks up to so either everybody on twitter everybody on whatever website social media could say what they want to about little wayne and Nicki minaj but they have loyalty to each other okay they've been around each other for a very long time they taught each other a lot about the business and i feel like um little wayne showed his loyalty just by, you know, posting Nicki Minaj's album date on his story. Like, that type of stuff is really big for certain artists because certain artists are really like Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne sometimes don't even know when he's on someone's song. I remember somebody asked him about a song that he did with Gucci Man, and he was like, oh, I don't even remember. They even asked him about songs that he did with Nicki. He didn't even remember, y'all. So, I just try my best not to fault him and stuff like this because maybe he didn't even know and he just know Nicki's dropping her album, but maybe he's not paying attention. I don't know, but... In a way, you know, that's why a lot of people are thinking that, oh my God, is this shady? Is this, you know, but I don't think that it is, y'all. And I'm gonna give you my third reason on why I feel like this is a great thing strategically for these two is because Nicki Minaj is one of those girls that like wants perfection. And the fact that her album is coming out on the same day as um, Lil Wayne, they are both want to listen to each other's album. And I feel like Nicki Minaj is still wanting, you know what I'm saying, to impress somebody that gave her the, the, the chance that she has now. Like, he really, really put her in the, like, the forefront. You feel me? Like, people didn't really know about her until Lil Wayne started hopping on her mixtapes and stuff. So, I feel like she, this is her chance to show him, like, look, I'm in my fifth, I'm doing my fifth album. You always believed in me. You always told me that I can do it. And here I am. I'm doing it right now. So, that would be the, like, this is going to be a great moment for y'all. Like, just, let's not take it into, like, negativity. If we kind of look at this as two great rappers dropping on the same day, it, it, an amazing day for the fans that want to buy the music. You know what I'm saying? Let's look at it like that rather than looking at the Twitters and all of that and what they have to say about Nicki and Lil Wayne. They will always be friends, y'all. Even if they don't talk every day, I'm pretty sure they're always going to be family and always going to have loyalty. Please don't ever look at him like a Drake because he's nothing like Drake. He's always had Nicki back, period. Like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Wanna know what you think about both of these amazing artists um, dropping on the same day. And which album is you want to buy first? I want to know. Like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. I'm out. I'm not even a man and got my d in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about y'all. Oh, here we go. August with the shade. Hold on, who we swinging on tonight? Why y'all gotta be swinging on somebody? Why people 